Ooh, welcome back to the Milwaukee Brewers franchise here in MLB 15, the show. This is episode 12, and in today's episode, we will have a game against the Los Angeles Dodgers in the second series before the All-Star break. We have a series against Dodgers, which is the first game we're going to be playing today against that series, and then a series against Pittsburgh, and then it is the All-Star break. So the halfway point of the season, and as of right now, our Brewers are sitting at first place. Heading into the, basically heading into the All-Star break. They will have to really uh, shit the bed to head into the All-Star break, not in first place, because they have a four-game lead on the St. Louis Cardinals, so it is possible to lose that, but the Brewers are playing some pretty good baseball, as like I said, they are 44 and 37. And one thing you will notice about today's pitching matchup is that Mike Bolsinger is going to be on the mound for us. And one thing you, if you don't, if you know about Mike Bolsinger, he is a former Los Angeles Dodger, and also a thing about him is he was in AAA pretty much all this season, and he wasn't in the rotation last episode, so who got hurt? Brett Anderson. Brett Anderson got hurt. Unfortunately, I did not have a screenshot of that. Uh, I'm a few episodes ahead of recording, or I think I might be right on par with this series. I know I'm multiple episodes ahead in, like, every other series, but with this one, I think I'm, like, maybe, like, one ahead or right on par. All I know is I don't have a screenshot of his injury right now, so that's not going to be in the episode here, but it will... He is injured, that's why Mike Bolzinger is getting the start against Alex Wood of the Dodgers. And Bolzinger is 1-1 one in one the season with a 2.05 ERA. He has taken Brett Anderson's spot in the rotation. While uh, Kella in the bullpen as a setup man has dropped his ERA down to 1.63, he's 2-0, and he's even got a save. And then Corey Kniebel has a 1.14 ERA with 26 saves in the season. He is on pace to be in the All-Star game as a closer. As the batting rotations, or the batting lineups goes, Jonathan Lucroy has a 319 batting average with 11 home runs and 40 RBIs. That 319 average is enough to lead the National League in batting average. And then Scott Van Slyke has really turned things around from early on around the season, where he was hitting less than 200 in the 100s. Well, now he's hitting 256 with 14 bombs and 36 RBI. So he's really stepped things up here in the season. While Scooter Jeanette, since returning from injury, has just not been Scooter Jeanette. He is hitting 213 with one home run and three RBI, which is not very good at all. Our 44 and 37 Milwaukee Brewers play host here at Miller Park to the Los Angeles Dodgers, the first place team from the NL West, who are 54 and 30 on the season. Mike Bolzinger gets the nod for the Brewers. He's one and one with a 2.05 since being called up from AAA. So top half of the first. Nobody out, one on first. Justin Turner will ground at the third. Hernandez hits Jeanette, who hits Jeanette, who fires over to first, and that's a 5-4-3 double play. And then Alex Wood on the mound for the Dodgers. The left-hander is 5-5 five five with a 3.07 ERA. So bottom half of the first, runners on first and second with two outs. Marisnik rounds out to third, and that's going to be the final out of that inning. So we're still scoreless at the end of one. Pick things up in the top half of the third. As Wilmer Flores goes down looking, Bolzinger picks up a K. To the bottom of the third be now. Alex Wood with two outs, gets Van Slyke to hit a little chopper right back to him. He fields that one, tosses over to first, no problemo, and we get through three innings. So to the top of the fourth we go as Lasiel Puig will ground out into a 5-4-3 double play, and that will end the inning there. So now we head to the top half of the fifth where Justin Upton, the newly acquired Dodger in the offseason, Picks up a nice little base hit there. He's got himself a single. Next batter up is Wilmer Flores. He's going to take this 1-0 pitch right past Van Slyke into right field. So that makes it first and second for the Dodgers. Next batter up is Austin Barnes, the catcher on the day with nobody out. He's going to rip one into the right center field gap. That'll slowly get to the track as it'll land in between Marisnik and Williams and bounce over the wall for a ground rule double. 1-0 Dodgers. So second and third now, Alex Wood, the opposing pitcher, is going to rip one right back at Van Slyke. He steps on first, fires home, but it's not in time as it's now 2-0 Dodgers. One out, runner on third, as Jose Peraza rips one down the left field line that'll land just fair as Davis can't quite get to it. The runner comes in, makes it a 3-0 Dodgers lead as we'll pick things back up in the bottom half of the sixth now. Brewers at the plate, Jonathan Lucroy with one out. Rips a single into center field, extends his NL lead leading average as he's on first base. Then later on, it's two outs, 0 2 count. Chris Davis rips one into the right center field gap opposite way. That'll hit up against the wall, and Jonathan Lucroy is going to get his catching legs all the way from first into home plate on the 
away on the bad throw to the plate. And it's now a 3-2-1 Dodgers lead as we pick things back up in the bottom half of the ninth. Kenley Jansen comes on, looking for his 30-second save of the season. And Chris Davis, nobody out, rips one up the middle for a base knock. He's on first base. Or correction, with two outs. And then Mason Williams comes up. He rips one into right field. And he... Gets on base as well. Keeps the inning alive. First and second now. Alberto Cayaspo comes on. He rips one up the middle. And that's going to be bases loaded for the Brewers with two outs. Chance to take the lead here with one swing on a home run. Kike Hernandez at the plate. 2-0 count. And he swings, grinds out the floor as the shortstop, and that is how the cookie crumbles. As Kike Hernandez just can't get the job done coming in a pinch hit for the pitcher as the Los Angeles Dodgers come away with the victory here by a score of 3-1 over the Milwaukee Brewers as the Brewers drop to 44-38 and, and the Dodgers improve to 55-30. and Player of the game for the Dodgers was Alex Wood. Eight innings pitched, gives up seven hits, but seven strikeouts with only one run. Chris Davis, three for four on the day with a double and an RBI. Jonathan Lucroy, three for four with a run. Alberto Cayaspo was two for two, but just wasn't enough to pick up a win for Bolzinger. As Alex Wood improves the six and five, Bolzinger drops the one and two, and Kenley Jansen picks up his 32nd save of the season. As that being said, to wrap things up, here for this edition of Milwaukee Brewers Baseball, I have been your host, Jersey Bourne, and I'm saying... Goodbye. Just another family torn.